Hi guys, it's Nina from Beer Focus. We are here in Amsterdam at Unity Unite 2017 conference and I'm sitting here with... Sarah Stumbo. I am the VR and AR evangelist at Unity. Can you tell me a little bit about what Unity is doing in VR, AR, all of the XR, all of the R's? Yeah, so right now all of the R's are a big focus for us. We're here at Unite to bring together all developers, whether it be um, mobile developers, console developers, but of course VR uh, remains near and dear to our hearts, especially for me. Um, I've been working in VR for a few years now and love the possibilities that Unity has given me for VR development. Uh, can you give me some of the examples of what is being showcased here, uh, what developers can find here with regards to all of the R's? Well, basically all of the tools that we're showing here can be applied to any form of development. We're really showcasing our new release, which is 2017.1, and a lot of the artist tools that go along with that. So for example, Timeline is an amazing tool for artists and developers alike to be able to sequence visually uh, animation sequences, audio, playable tracks all together in one. And that tool will really help uh, enable much quicker development for VR and AR developers as well. So you mentioned an XR toolkit to, as to some degree. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Yeah, that's something that we're working on right now. It won't be ready uh, until, I believe, this fall, but we're really excited about it. Uh, the toolkit will aim to dramatically improve the experience of developing for VR, especially when it comes to the inputs. So there's so many VR platforms now. Uh, Oculus, Vive, um, Microsoft has their VR headset now. And what we really aim to do is to make all of those inputs, uh, all of the controls for them cross-platform so that you can build one experience for VR and deploy it to all, all the of the headsets. headsets. Yeah, and the toolkit will be a really great starting point for developers to, to get started quickly. Yeah, that'll save a lot of time. And you yeah. also mentioned there was another toolkit that, uh, that you guys also have. Uh, yeah, well, actually, one of our developers who's here at Unite has made an amazing toolkit called VRTK. That's kind of a more uh, high-level one, so we're focused more on the low-level features there. So it seems like what Unity is doing, they want a lot of sort of sharing of information yeah. to make sure that the community is growing with regards to the space. So is there an area that our developers or viewers can go to to join you guys, join the hub? Yeah, absolutely. Um, if you're interested in learning Unity, you can go to unity3.com slash learn. And there's a ton of tutorials and information to get started. We also have an amazing community on our forums. Uh, and that's like one of one of the most special parts about Unity, I think, is the community and every developer wants to help each other because we're all rooting for each other to make amazing games and experiences in Unity. And what are you most excited about for the future of, of the different realities? Oh, the different realities. I love the, I think the potential for sharing and social experiences in VR is really amazing. I think the first time that I actually tried a VR experience with someone else in there and we got to share, like, this new world together, it was really powerful. Sounds like a Disney movie. Yes. Sounds romantic. <laughs> a whole new world. Oh, God. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much for this interview. Go to VRFocus.com if you want to find out any more information about VR, AR, or any of the latest stuff coming out at Unite 2017. And I will see you there. Thank you so much. Bye. Bye. <laughs>